report. In terms of an investigation, we have the number two is going to, or potentially the number two to the Justice Department is going to have his hearing tomorrow. Um, uh, what uh, would you expect that he's going to get asked about special prosecutor? I would expect that. I would expect it. I would hope that he would push back good and hard because there's nothing. <laughs> Greta, a special Invest, a special prosecutor is appointed when there is some indication that there's a crime to be investigated. The only crime that I'm aware of in connection with this whole matter is the crime of hacking the Democratic National Committee and its, and, and its chair uh, way back when. Um, and we know who did that. It was the Russians. There's no other crime, as far as I know, to investigate. And so appointing somebody to simply take a look at in, 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 the, in the abstract at the situation is not something that prosecutors do. You know, there's such an awful war of words here in this town that's poisoning every sort of opportunity to try to get at the truth or to find out what happened on any given day. The um, leader of the Democratic Party, Nancy Pelosi, said the other day that because the attorney general recused himself that he must have done something wrong, that recusing someone means that's he did something wrong. Well, that's no, absurd. I, I'm I know. All I, every single lawyer cringed at that. There's a, there's a section in the Code of Federal Regulations that says that if you were involved in a campaign and there is an investigation of that campaign, then you're supposed to recuse yourself. I think he was recusing himself prematurely because, again, there's no investigation, no criminal investigation going on that we're aware of. So the, at, at worst, the recusal was doing more than was required.